So I have some things that I'm going to talk about now that I think are so important. Um, I, I specifically want to talk to the ones of us. And I say us because it's definitely me as well. That are living stressed and lonely lives. This is a vlog for the stressed and the lonely. Now, one of the things that always happens when you start moving forward is that you will get to a plateau where you look around and you are alone. And it's not for the lack of trying to have other people with you. You, you invite them to be with you. You want them to walk with you and, and, and sup with you and spend time with you. But they're the wrong people at the wrong time. And you can try and make them fit, but they don't. And it's unfortunate because we desire company. We desire to be in community. We, we know that we are better when we are together. But you can't make someone be there for you who isn't called to be with you. I mean, you could have the greatest idea in the world. And you can see someone who has a comparable talent that... If, if the two of you came together, what you could possibly create. But they are the wrong person at the wrong time. And you can try and make them fit. You can spend time on them. You can invest money in them. You can pray them to be sober. And all the things that you think are the reasons why they can't connect to you. But when all those things are fixed and they still can't be there. They're the wrong people at the wrong time. And the sooner you come to grips with that, the freer you're going to become and the less stressful your life will be. See, you're not stressed because you're overworked. You're stressed because you're trying to carry this load by yourself. That's exactly why you're stressed. And you're stressed because you want to talk about your vision in real time and no one's there to talk to. You're stressed because whatever it is that you know that you're ultimately here on this planet in this realm to do, you can't even get started. Because where's your help? Where's your companion? Who are the ones that have been called to walk beside you and not just behind you? And not just participate in your success, but they're actually part of the evolution of it. And you can hold yourself back and you can hold everything back and you can believe with all your heart, mind, and soul that if I just wait one more minute, that person's going to show up. But I'm here to tell you they're not coming. Loneliness that you feel, this isolation that you feel, is part of the germination and gestation period that you're in right now. I wish someone else could be in there with you but they're not designed to be in there. As many women in the world who have babies, no other woman who even has ever done it before can help that lady have her baby because it is a solo, isolated moment giving birth. Men, we're so used to being in teams and having our buddies around us and we do everything in committee. But when the dream that's inside of you needs to be birthed, I don't know if you're going to have a team around you. You're not going to have someone bearing witness and applauding you and patting you on your back and saying, you, you hang in there, brother. It's isolated. It's lonely. And it's stressful. Oh, it's stressful. But it's the kind of stress that if you really think about it, it's the best stress in the world because it's telling you you're growing. It's telling you that something is shifting and stretching you in a way that you didn't know you needed to be stretched. It's exactly the process. A lot, will give, a lot of people will give up in this exact moment and they'll reach back for that old thing that they always had around them, that warm blanket, one more bottle of liquor, one more girlfriend, one more distraction. Because I can't stay on my own journey by myself. It's too lonely. It's too isolating. It's too stressful. 
So I want you to think about the things that you've been feeling, and I want you to think about think about them in a different way today and the rest of this week. And know that where you are right now, that stress level, that isolation is a good thing. It's a good thing. And please stay the course. Do not fall back into your old habits. Do not give up. You are closer to the finish line than you ever knew. I am right at the doorstep of me taking the state exam and this national exam for my real estate license. It is a lot of information and I pray I retain it, but I have to do it because what I want to build, the vision of Eden does, is on the other side of this. I know it is. And the people who will be with me then will be so grateful to me now for staying the course and not giving up. Am I lonely? Yes. Am I stressed? Absolutely. But I'm good. I'm good. And I'm going to be better. This is Brother Eden Douglas. I want you to be blessed all this week and the rest of this month. Listen to this message again. I think it really helped some of you. Peace.